this what's happened cornflower what's the matter cornflower are you all right constance constance wake up something terrible has happened we have to get everyone out of the rain Right. Oh, my head. Oh, no. Wake up. Wake up. <laughs> oh. Come on, you all. <laughs> Too much trifle, he reckons. Not trifle, old dirt digger. Something much worse. I feel like I got bonked on the bean. Basil, ring the bells and search the grounds. We've got to find out what's happened here. Righto. Dirty work at the crossroads, eh? What? By the north wall gate. Mama. Oh no. What's happened, Constance? Cornflower, over here. It's Letty Bankful. <gasps> Who did this? There, there. Poor little Rolo. Have you seen Matameo? Probably hiding, with the others. Why would anyone want to hurt such a harmless creature? Stop them! Get back, Mrs. Mrs. Bagvole! No, oh, stop! Hugo! Where's Hugo? Take him inside. I'll try to find Hugo. Right. And keep an eye out for the young ones. I haven't seen any of them. Search Cavern Hole. I'll get some help and search outside the gates. Matameo! Tess! Tim! Tess! Matameo! Maybe we should stop back, Matthias. I don't think Friar Hugo could have run farther than this. You're probably right. Over here! Quickly! Hugo, my old lad. What did they do to you? Oh no. Why this? Why? Why is right. And who? Alright, everyone. We've been attacked. 
We were fooled. Taken in by that rotten fox and his gang. Filthy cowards. <sighs> Twist them rascally dirtbags, foxes and the like. Them magic us to sleep in. It wasn't magic, Formal. It was this. Hmm. We were drugged, my dears. Some sleeping potion or other. Mm. Enough! Huh? Excuse the outburst, my friends, but time is of the essence. We must try to make sense of what has happened here. I too believe that the fox magician drugged us, then fled. The question is, why? Perhaps John Churchmouse knows something. <laughs> Any sign of Matameo? They're still looking. Matameo? Matameo, is that you? No, John. It's Matthias. Matthias. Can you tell us what happened? We were so busy at the feast. Neither of us had taken the time to eat or, or drink anything. Then we saw them. On my oath, Matthias, we fought! Letty, Hugo... But they were too many to stop them from their awful plan. What plan, John? What was it they wanted? Our young ones, Matthias. They took my Tim and Tess. <gasps> they took Sam Squirrel and Cynthia Bankfall and... and your Matty Mayo. <laughs> I'll bring him back, Cornflower. I'll bring them all back. I swear it on Martin's sword. <laughs> to me! To me! Red Wall to me! Uh, uh... Oi, Mouse! Come on, spoiled baby. Little Abby pet. What are you gonna do now, eh? <laughs> Whoa! Uh, help! Watch out for Three Claws. He's a cruel one. Thanks. My name is Alma, daughter of Orlando the Axe from the Western Plains. And Matameo, son of Matthias the Warrior from Redwall Abbey. So you're the one he wanted so badly. Who wanted me? The one who stole us all away. Slegar the Cruel. Don't worry, my dad will rescue us. He'll be out searching already. My dad too, but they won't find us. I've seen things. Slagar clears his tracks and makes false ones. Our rescuers will all go the wrong way. Don't tell the others. Listen carefully. Our main group will head south. Meanwhile, Fengal and Deadnose will take the cart and lay a false trail to the north. Afterwards, they can circle back east to rejoin us. <laughs> <laughs> By the claw! Even the weather is on my side. The Red Wallers won't have any idea which way we've gone. Now, let's get them moving. <gasps> I am Slagar the Cruel, and you are my slaves. <laughs> Understand this. If I say war, you walk. If I say run, you run. If I decide that you may live, then you may live. If I take it into my head that you may not live, then you will die. Now! Move! 
We've been up the north road, but the rain is too heavy, so there are no tracks. Couldn't make out a confounded thing with all that sky juice pouring down. <sighs> You'd better read this. Sister Agnes found it by the north wall gate. It seems young Vich, whom we took in and cared for, was spying on the Abbey, assisting the fox. It's Vich's writing, all right. And it's all about us. No wonder the foxy blighter knew I was a stomach on legs. Matameo never did take to Vich. There is something wrong about Vich. I just know it. I'm sorry, Matty. I should have trusted you. Right. Dawn tomorrow. Rain or no rain, we strike north. We'll make that masked fox wish he'd never seen our gates. I agree. But first, the light is failing. And before it goes, we must pay our respects to two of our valiant comrades. I'll find you, Matty. If it takes the rest of my life, I will find you. Here's a tip. Don't let the running line drag behind you. Hold it in your paws like this, and you won't trip. It makes it a bit easier for us all. Thanks for your help, Alma. You're tough. <laughs> Not really. My mom died three years ago, so Dad and me had to look after ourselves. You know how it is. Be strong, Matameo. Find a way to be strong. I know you have it in you, and I'm sorry I didn't listen to what was inside you, my son. I can't go on. Why won't they let us sleep? <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> Stop sniveling, Cynthia. You've done nothing but moan and cry all day. Matameo, don't. Why not? She's a whining nuisance. <laughs> Your father would never talk to another creature like that. <sighs> Why should I have to be like my father anyway? Because you are the son of the Redwall warrior. And others not as strong as you need your leadership and protection. I... Uh... Shut up over here! <sighs> Just think, if it wasn't for Matt the Brat here, the rest of you might be safe and cozy back at the Abbey. <laughs> You, Red Wolf, won't think you're so clever, don't you? Well, let me tell you something to cheer you up. Slagar and I took care of the cook and that loudmouth Mrs. Bankwall. And that dozy father of yours, too. We kill them all, good and proper. <laughs> 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 
mine. Get up! You are the troublemaker, son of Matthias. All Redwall knows that. I'll teach you a lesson you won't forget before you're much older. One more stunt like that, and you'll be chained in with them. What are you waiting for? Get these slaves moving! And pick up the pace! My friends, we march north. Filthy stuff, Rain. Not much fun to drink. Sooner have October ale any day. What? What? Stop chunnering, you great old feedbag, and get tracking for signs. Right o sir! Eyes front and all that. Listen up, troops! Quicks the word, sharps the action. This rain is going to make tracking harder than ever. Bally rains washed the evidence away, old bean. It's like tracking fish in a river. Can't give up, Basil. Can't and won't. Weasels, what's all this? Laying about like a load of saturated stoats, a pile of moonstruck moles. Come on! Chins in, chests out, jump to attention! Yes, your ballet! Oh! Basil, are you hurt? Hurt? I think I've been skewered by a tree trunk. Take a gander, that's a good old lad. Jess, give us a hand, will you? The rest of you carry on up the road. We'll catch up later. Give them mud and vinegar, ma'am. Just like my old mum used to give them. Ouch! Oh, what are you doing, Jess? Trying to hack me old paw off? Stay still, you flop-eared food bin. It's just a splinter. A splinter? More like a javelin or an enemy spear, you tiny tree walloper. Ow! Hmm. What do you make of this, Matthias? Blue paint. I'd bet a bushel of acorns to a cask of ale. It's from that fox's cart. Looks like our large and loud friend here was right, Jess. It is an enemy spear. See the trouble and pain I go through to find clues for you buffers? I say, isn't that a piece of the foxfella's cape? Yes, and here's a broken branch. The rain didn't do that. And here, axle grease. Look, these don't line up north-south. They're traveling east, through the forest. Let's get a move on. That cart will slow those blighters down. We may surprise them yet! Well, what about the others? They'll come back eventually. I'll leave them a note. Come on, hauling the cart will slow them down. Matame and the others might be close by. Listen closely to my story, Mouse. Many seasons ago, during the wars against Cluny the Scourge, Matthias the Great Redwall Warrior betrayed my sainted mother. Your mother? They sent her to her doom. To a horrible, undeserving death. And she was no more than a humble healer. A healer? Wait a minute. My father told me this story. It didn't go like that. Silence when I speak! <gasps> How would you know what happened? I was there. I was denied my liberty, imprisoned in what they jokingly called an infirmary. No Red Waller would imprison an innocent creature. Our infirmary is for the sick, not for captives. <laughs> is that what they told you? <laughs> Lies. All lies. I was forced to flee for my life. 
hunted down like a common criminal, and I had done nothing. Sarah the Fox? That was the healer's name, and she had a son. Oh. Sella's son, murder of Methuselah. But he was killed. <laughs> Not killed. I ran. And the warrior, he chased me. I had to hide. I am chicken. And your father did this to me! No, I know the truth. You did it to yourself. The truth? You want to know the truth, Max? Matthias, warrior of Redwall, will know pain when his only son is made to suffer as Slager has suffered. <sighs> That is the truth, Mouse. And that is a promise. Too blinking obvious. Not enough paw prints. Jolly suspicious. I found the cart. It's just up ahead. Dash my whiskers. Good work, Jess. But let's move in carefully. It might be a trap. I'd better hot dinner on it. Thank you.